We'll guide you through how to enable 5 GHz or 5G on your PC or laptop. If you find this useful, then consider subscribing and liking the video. What this essentially means is that you will then be able to connect to 5G or 5 GHz networks. First of all, let's make sure that your wireless adapter can go and do this. Come to the bottom of your computer and click on search and go and type in CMD or command prompt. You're going to get this pop up and then all you need to do is go and type in net sh space wlan space show space drivers. Press enter and you'll go and get this um, back here. And what you want to do is locate radio type supported. So now you're going to see the different radio types here. What you can then do is just go and search for what five gigahertz radio types and you can see the different ones here. So if we go and compare them, if you find out that yours doesn't support 5G or 5 gigahertz, you'll need a different wireless adapter. However, if yours does, but you still can't go and see them, then what you need to do is come to the bottom of your computer and click on search and type in device manager, like so. In device manager, you need to go and locate network adapters and expand it using the arrow on the left and find your network adapter. I know mine is this one here. Then what you can do is go and right click on it and click on properties and you'll get this pop up. You need to come into advanced. Now what you want to do is go and select a band selection and make sure it's set to all band in the value. If it's set to 2.4G only, that's why you can't go and see 5G. Same thing for preferred bands, you can go and set it to no preference or five gigahertz band as well, but I like to have them all. Also for the five gigahertz channel bandwidth, just go and set it to auto as well. Then click okay and you can close out of this and now go and see if you can see the 5G networks as hopefully you should have en enabled it now. If you still can't go and see 5 GHz networks, then make sure your wireless adapter drivers are firstly installed and also up to date as well. You can do that in the device manager and also from the manufacturer's website. After you've gone and installed or updated them, try restarting your computer and then hopefully 5 GHz networks should then be visible. If you found this useful, then please leave a like.